Hello everyone, I'm the Moy Chicken and welcome back to more Castlevania Harmony of Dissonance. In the last episode, we met up with our boyfriend Maxim again and he gave us a lovely bracelet. He gave us his brocelet, so now we have both bracelets and we can go up to the, um, up to the Cathedral of Dissonance because I believe now we can open that sealed door. I think what we needed was his bracelet as well, so... Let's go up there. Um, actually, there was a, uh... First, there is a something... What was this that I didn't go to over and up? Let's see. Let's check that out first. Let's immediately get distracted, and then, uh, it'll be great. Uh, so let's see. What was up? What was this? What's up here? Yeah. Uh, why did I not go up here, though, I wonder? Deadly. Um... Yeah, weird. Why did I not go up here? Eh. Oh, oh, go away. Stupid thing. Whoa! Oh, that's awesome! That's That looks like it's gonna be really useful. Bolt book! Whoa! Bolt book! Oh, I can't do it again. Oh, it uses lots and lots. You know, that that is always the case in video games that, like, the, uh, you get, like, the super awesome move, and then unfortunately it takes up all of the resources. So you can't use it? What's going on? Hang on, something weird's going on with my controller. Give me a sec. Alright, uh, I don't know what was going on. It's like, um... It's like my controller was just doing... things on its own. I saw furniture! Never mind the thing about the controller, I saw furniture. I need it. Oh, I need that furniture! Oh, that sweet, sweet gold trinket. Look like a candelabra. That sweet, sweet gold trinket. Oh, it's so important. I really have to get back to my room so I can put up all of this amazing furniture I've been finding. Because that is the main thrust of this game, right? Finding furniture. Oh, sweet, what's this? It's a silver trinket. So now we have a silver trinket and a gold trinket. And I definitely want this. It's much cooler. It shoots lightning. Real lightning. Um, and that's cool. Uh, so yeah, we, we need to get back and go to the, uh, to the Chapel of Dissonance because I believe, I believe we're about to get some more plot, if I remember correctly. I think we're about to actually meet, uh, Lydia, because I think that she is trapped up there. So that is exciting. So let's just go and do that. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And then there's a giant, uh, what are these things called? Big bal balloon, balloon pod? Balloon seed? Something like that? Eh. Well, he just... He just missed. I gave him every opportunity to hit me, and he was just sort of like, I'm gonna get him! I'm gonna... Ow! <laughs> Wait, no, this is where we met Maxim. Okay, I went the wrong way. Went the wrong way! Turn around! <laughs> Turn around! Went the wrong way! <laughs> okay, so here's, here's a question for you out there who play these exploration kind of games. Are you good at remembering directions? I find in, in games like this, I have to constantly be checking the map, or I just immediately get lost. I don't know, I'm, I'm, I'm just not great at remembering directions. Unless it's a game that I feel like I've played a lot, or it's a game that has a lot of, like, really distinctive and memorable areas. Like, I, I almost never get lost in something like Super Metroid or uh, Link to the Past, but that's because i played them so much. A and their, their areas are very distinctive and memorable. Whereas in this game, it's sort of like, uh... I mean, they're, they're, they're distinctive, they're distinct areas, don't get me wrong, but... You know, not as distinctive, I guess. <laughs> not as distinctive. Another one that, that I usually know exactly where I am is uh, Symphony of the Night. That game had a lot of, like, very distinct locations. This game? Nope. I keep forgetting where I'm going. So, ow, I got shot with an arrow. Stop it. <laughs> Just shoot you with lightning. Stop it. Eh. Eh. It's a good time for me and not you. You guys remember this this area where we saw the the, the spooky time faces in the, in the windows? That was a good time. <laughs> that was fun. I remember that. It's so strange to me that uh, magic is not refilled by uh, hearts in this game. You know, magic the magic just kind of comes back on its own over time. So uh, I keep getting these hearts, thinking that I'm doing something. Uh, I haven't used this yet, have I? Wow. Man, the bolt book is really good, but I guess everything uses up a lot of MP. I guess that's the, uh, the trade-off. Alright, so now we're here again. And once again, we have the evil... 
<laughs> Evil Virgin Mary picture, which uh, it sort of looks like a baby now that I look at it, like a nonplussed baby. I don't know, it's a, it's a little strange, but... And then there's this... This, this kind of looks like a, a statue of like a... Or a stained glass window of like a um, a guy wearing like a cross helm. And he's got one... He's got his left arm raised up over him. And he's like, why you? I don't know. That's what I see in it. <laughs> that's what I saw in that. It's very strange. Ooh, a flying buttress. So I know the purpose of a buttress. But what's the purpose of a flying buttress? Is it just that it's less heavy? Is that the point? <laughs> Is that the point of that architecture? I'm not really sure. I don't know a whole lot about architecture. Which is a shame, because I actually took classes on architecture, but I still don't know much about them. <laughs> much about it. But what did I just pick up? Is that good? Do I want that? Guardian armor... It was like a cloak, I think. Cloak? 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 Uh, goods? Cloak? Oh, here we go. I saw it. Emerald cloak. A bright green cloak. Meh. I like my luck. Luck's important to me. Luck is very important to me in a game like this. I want to be lucky. Lucky, 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 just. Must be lucky. I want that up there, whatever that is. Uh, can I? Oh, I, okay, I think I can do it. I think I don't think I'm supposed to be able to go up there yet, but I think I can cheat it. Let's see. Every once in a while in, in this kind of game, you can do this sort of thing where you like, ch uh, come on. All right, throw your, throw your thing. You. You. Ow, oh, I just bumped into him. Alright, get out of here. Alright, come on. Come on, I want, I want to succeed at this. No. Ooh, okay, that's a, that's a good that's a good customer. Ow, I just bumped into him again. Dang it. Dang it. Eh. It's possible. It's possible. It's doable. Ow. Especially if I get a spear thrown in my head. All right, come on. Eh. Oh, it's so close. Okay. Okay. Nah, maybe not. I thought it looked doable. Maybe it's not. Uh. No, not doable. Go uh, well, that's way too. Ah. You just suck, dude. Alright, I'll come back later. I think I need whatever that is up there. It's probably another Dracula thing. But let's get on with the actual goal, which is to go through this door. This sealed door. Locked with magic spell. So, uh, first we go up here and see what's up here. It's very important. Because there might be good stuff. There is, in fact, good stuff. I want this. And I want, don't want to get hit by that. But I did anyway. I'm playing super great tonight, just so y'all know, just in case you weren't able to tell from this immaculate gameplay. Yes, I'm super good. Alright. Uh, put on my MK's bracelet. Alright, can I get it now? Held Maxim's bracelet above head! Opens the door. And now we are at the uh, the the throne room, the famous Castlevania throne room. I'm gonna switch back to my, my bracelet. <laughs> I've grown attached to this bracelet, as the game tells me. Um, what about? Oh yeah, I need to switch the crushing stone. The crushing stone. All right. Charging up. And pa. Now I'm gonna switch back because I want my whip deadly. It's important. It's important to me. I need to be able to whip deadly. Oh, there's some sweet 3D graphics in the background. Look at them go. Look at it go. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, that looks significant. <laughs> Remember that? Oh, it's a, it's a portal. Well, that's helpful. Hint card three tells us. What does hint card three tell us? It tells us, kneel before the round gate to be taken to a different place. Okay. Kneel. Oh. Where am I now? <gasps> oh, look at that. It's like a teleporter. Well, that's very helpful. Oh, can I just go two places? Okay, I can only go two places right now. Well, that's still very helpful. All right, looks like we got a boss. Inside we find, uh, no nothing. Not a whole lot. Oh, it's breaking. Something's breaking. Oh, hello. 
How are you? It's Pazuzu! I always loved the name Pazuzu. I always thought it sounded so cool. Pazuzu! Oh, you shoot fireballs. They kind of look like the fireballs from uh, Contra, actually. Pazuzu! Oh. Hang on. <laughs> Hang on, gotta turn my spellbook off. Spellbook off. This guy so far isn't too hard, actually. You are not Dracula. Why are you here? I'm just gonna throw axes at you. And that will be our relationship. Axes! Axes! Uh, I feel like I got this guy in a rut, kind of. Yep. It's working out just fine for me. Oh, okay, there, there we go. He did something different. <laughs> thrilling boss fight, wherein I just throw axes at Pazuzu. Pazuzu! And then I just duck. Oh, and he summons buddies. Nice mini-demons, bro. Totally couldn't handle them. Boy, I tell you what, Pazuzu, you are so dangerous. Well, crap, this was not... Ah, uh, good? Yeah, this was not, uh, anything relating to Lydia. Oh, there she is. Lydia! Just, is it really you? Just. Nice bed. Can I have it for my room? Are you alright? Are you injured? Is she just really short? She looks like she's really short. Or is she kneeling? I can't tell. I'm fine. Maxim had me tucked away safely in here. Maxim had me tucked safely away here. He, he put me into bed and everything. It was lovely. Oh, I see. Didn't he come with you? Maxim's waiting for us outside, I think. Hey, what happened to the person that brought me to this place? You mean that you don't know who it was that kidnapped you? Until Maxim came to my rescue, I... I was blindfolded. I see. You don't see. Okay, let's get out, try to get out of this place. That was a terrible joke. Yes, let's go. Oh no, it's freaking death! Oh my god, it's death! <laughs> so, this is where you've been hiding. He too is a bold man. <laughs> this one's mine. I'm taking this penguin for my own. No! Lydia! I shall have this maiden for myself. No! Just! Just! Save me! Boah! Damn, I must hurry after them. Shake fist. <laughs> hurry after them where? We don't know where to go. Got this nice bed, though. I kind of want this. <laughs> Oh, I just noticed I'm up against time. Okay, well, well hang on. Let's see what's, uh, what's over here. Not a whole lot. Not a whole lot. Okay, well, we'll go up here. We'll go up here. We'll get this. And, uh, this. Uh, that's about it. Okay, well, in the next episode, we will, I guess, chase after death. And Lydia, now that we found her, she immediately got kidnapped. Again. Because it's a video game. I am the White Chicken, and this is Castlevania Harmony of Dissonance. Thanks for stopping by. Chicka, chicka.